A little over four months ago, I started this project to gather materials from my garden pond, put them in a jar and seal the lid forever. This concept is commonly known as an ecosphere. It's a fairly cheap and easy thing to do and I highly recommend anybody who's thinking about doing it to jump on board and give it a go. If you haven't yet already watched the first video where I set up the ecosphere, you can find a link to it in the description. This is what the ecosphere looks like now, a little over four months since the lid was closed. As you can see, there's plenty of life still surviving inside the jar with absolutely zero influence from the outside world. This really does prove the concept of photosynthesis, as without the plants there will be no oxygen for the animals inside to survive. When I made the first video setting up the ecosphere, I made it quite clear that there were some eggs on the lily pad. I identified these eggs to be snails. Now, four months later, the snail population of this ecosphere has exploded. It's unfortunate that I don't have any footage of them when they were just hatched, but now you can already see they've grown quite a lot. Once I'd set the ecosphere up, I became immediately aware of the leeches. I'd often see them crawling across the glass. There's also other wriggly things inside the ecosphere, such as this worm. It's quite hard to record these guys without the footage being blurry. Shortly after I set up the ecosphere, I noticed the population of these aquatic isopods was growing. I'd constantly see them in and about the algae, which had grown as a result from the ecosphere being in direct sunlight sat on my windowsill. I don't see this as a bad thing, as the algae will help to produce oxygen and feed the animals inside the ecosphere. What was particularly strange though, was that on two separate occasions, I'd noticed there to be multiple aquatic isopods, dead, above the water line, stuck to the glass. I don't know why this happened, so if anybody knows the answer, please let me know. Fortunately, the population was never brought to zero, so on both occasions the population was able to recover. The whole point of an ecosphere is to really get close in, look carefully, and try and see what you can find. In this short clip there's tons of life. I've replayed the clip now and highlighted all the things that I could see. I'm sure there's plenty that I've missed so please let me know if you can see any. So there we have it. The ecosphere four months later. I'll be sure to do another update video in a few months time, so please subscribe to my channel if you're interested in seeing how this ecosphere progresses.